Hello guys, it's Gorman Crofter here, welcome back to another episode of Twilight Princess HD. I told you we would kill bats this episode, so let's kill some bats. I actually just ran past them, because I didn't give a fuck. And here we are at... What's that? <gasps> what is that? It's a pouch. We can sniff it. And... It's Ilya's leg pouch. Link, can you at least promise me this? Just, we already read this. <laughs> Uh, just come back home safely. Oh, Ilya! Uh, you learned the scent of Ilya. Wait, I never learned. I never learned the youth scent, so we didn't have to forget it. Well, I guess smell the girl. Oh, I can tell by the look in your face. Well, good. It's not a clue then. But this scent could be quite old. I wonder if she's still alright. Oh, that's so mean to say. That's like the meanest thing you can say in that situation, Midna. You are such a bitch. Oh God. Well, anyway, let's follow the scent. I don't need to follow the scent. The scent, the scent actually, if you follow the scent, it, uh, <laughs> it, it it makes you go like all around Castle Town, even though that's like a way shorter route. So, don't follow the scent. Just follow my my guidance. Hey, haven't we seen this castle before? So we finally made it back there. Well, only the father. So hang in there. Uh, it's going to be a lot harder from here. I, that's what she said. <laughs> Uh, God, and I'm actually thinking of like Midna giving a uh, hand job with that giant hand thing of hers. Yeah, let's not do that. Let's keep this 12 plus game, 12 plus commentary, I suppose. Hello. Oh God, there's a lot of things. And oh, there's a bow. And oh, there's a birds as well. There's multiple birds. And oh God, and we're being attacked. Oh, there's so three birds. That's a lot of birds. Look at that triple bird kill. Oh well, they're not dead, but oh, now they are. Let's run. <laughs> Alright, that was a pretty epic fight, actually. It didn't take any damage. See, I am born for hero mode. It's my jam. I'm definitely not gonna suck at the rest of the game or something. No, not planning on doing that. Still feeling like the, the yellow things are the actual clouds. And not the black. Even though Midna says that all oh, the black clouds of Twilight looks so good. Still thinking it's the yellow stuff. But now you are lying to me, aren't you? Well, stupid. Huh. I'm getting a bit tired, but we are almost there. We have almost traversed enough twilight area. And there's some more enemies, we're just gonna run past them because... Really there's no use in killing them in hero mode. Because they don't drop hearts. Rupees we have plenty of and... Like, little amounts of rupees aren't really gonna do much. Over time, you, it's all about... It's all about the big money. If you know what I... What? Just die, please. Boom. Boom! No. Just kill it. All of it. I don't have to. But, ah oh well. Hey, Lou! How are you? Boom, you're all dead. That's what you are. That's how you are. Dead. Anyway, someone just left the door opened. I guess that's a good thing. We can just... Hmm. I wonder, why did the Shadow Beast not enter the village or the town? I mean, it, it's opened up, they can just bash in and kill everyone, pretty much. Uh, why would they not? That's interesting. Also, why are the guards of the town not protecting the town against the monsters that are like, literally, like 20 meters outside of the town? Why aren't the guards, like, fending them off? <laughs> I think there's literally no one here, but two people holding groceries. Uh, anyway, the scent sends you that way. Uh, we're actually going to go... I mean, this is the shortest way, but this is the more interesting path. Uh, so, I mean, there's like four paths you can get. There's a lot of paths. Uh, the sand path goes like all the way around the village. We're actually going to take it a little bit shorter. Uh, we're going to go to the central town square. Because uh, there's like over here, you can see something that looks a lot like a fountain. But it's empty. And these people are stuck like, the fact that we can't take a path because of the water outage, it's a big deal. I think it's fine. It's not like you smell, it doesn't bother me. Or maybe it doesn't bother you because you're the one who stinks! <laughs> Your spirits, you can't smell. Um, <laughs> well, I guess they're not really, they don't even know their spirits. But I will. <laughs> um, yeah, there's just people everywhere talking about how there's no water and stuff. So there's definitely a problem in the land of Hyrule. There's a water outage. Which is bad because um, water 
it's a pretty important part of like life and stuff. Anyway, as you can see, the scent comes from this alleyway, um, and it actually goes here. So the thing would have sent you all the way around like that, and you could have also gone through here, uh, which would have been even shorter. But over here, are some Gorons. I have a limited supply of hot spring water. The race goes to the swift, as it is said. Yes. No pushing. If you want hot spring water, form the line. It's selling water. That's awesome. Goron's doing the business, as always, because they're so smart, you know. <laughs> Thomas Bar opened, and we have to go inside of there. Like that. And we're gonna get a cutscene. It's gonna be a cutscene. Hello! Alia. She is. Alia. How are you today? And it's Zora. This boy, can you save him? Alright, the lady try to settle down, okay? I just now sent out for the doctor. But it's a strange. The child of the Zoras. I wonder if this is all related to the incident that the soldiers were talking about in the back. Ah, yeah. oh, what an emotional reunion. Yes, a girl and her wolf. That's a fan fiction. Okay. For sure. Yeah. <laughs> but okay. you know how it goes. These folks don't see you either. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh. And over here are some guards. We've had a ton of complaints from the citizens who can't spend prayers to the lake in the spring spirit of Lake Hylia. Go there. The location is on the sh on his, is the one I showed you on the map earlier. Got it? Nope. <laughs> what? Study it now and know it well. <laughs> Alright. So you can actually look at the map and it'll be like... Over here is the lake spring. I've received orders from above to investigate why we can't go to the little spring in Lake Hylia. So I suppose that's where we should head as well. So yeah, let's go out and do... And let's head to Lake Hylia then. That would seem like the best course of action. In deed, deed, deed. Is there anything else interesting around here? What's over there? I'm target these. Oh, there's actually bugs already. I forgot about that. That's pretty cool. Uh, can you come over here, bug? I hope that's the only one. Oh, can you? Oh, we can't grab it yet because we don't have the spirits thing. Damn it, we're gonna have to come back here. That sucks. Um, what's the shortest? Oh, we can't actually go there because of the line. Uh, yeah, there's no way you can, there's no way you can go, but here then. All right, so let's go to Lake Hylia. Loading screen <laughs> kind of ruins the moment. I kind of wonder why this place can't be made seamless. I mean, all of Hyrule feel the seamless. You would think that they'd be able to make this. Although this is a more detailed area, of course, but still. Would be nice to have a more seamless game. The new Zelda is gonna be that. Probably, probably not gonna have town seamless though. I, I, I'd be surprised if towns would be seamless in the in the new Zelda. Because, I don't know. I, I'd be surprised for that. Because Zelda games are like infamous for like stopping the town in, uh, stopping the time in towns and stuff. They wouldn't really be able to do that then. Well, they they might pull like a Majora's Mask and have like daily routines for all the people. So they just walk around and stuff. That'd be cool. I'd love that. Speculating Zelda U inside my Twilight Princess Let's Play. That's probably probably the most interesting thing to talk about, to be honest. But other, other than the game. I don't have a lot of other things to talk about, to be honest. I have a pretty boring life. Things are happening. Um, I'm actually... I'm kind of getting ready for exam season, so that's exciting. Anyway, we are at the Bridge of Hylia. Look at that bridge. The Great Bridge of Hylia, even. I forgot about the greatness part of it, and it looks so awesome! I love this ridge! Like, the pillars of it are broken, and down there is a lake, and that's not really a lake, is it? That's more of a puddle. <laughs> oh well. Whatever floats your boat, oh well. I mean, this lake isn't really gonna float a lot of boats, since it's just a puddle, but oh well. What is all of this black stuff? It's all shiny. Since when our bridge is shiny? Do you smell anything funny? Uh, I smell black stuff. <laughs> I mean, the toilet's filled with black stuff. Oh god. Hello. Um, what are you doing? That's a flaming arrow. Um, uh oh. That's not good. No, no, no. No! The bridge is on fire. 
Uh, oh no, we're trapped. Get us out of here. I shall get us out of here. Jump! Whee! Oh, I'm falling. This is a long drop down. Whew. Sheesh. That was uh, that was a close one. Yeah. Well said. Took the words right out of my mouth. Midna. We are lucky there was a pot of them below here, huh? So this is Lake Hylia. But there's so little water. Sorry, the spirits spring should be around here as well. Anyway, let's take a look around. Yes, let's sh take a look around, shall we? Oh, there's Zoras. Hello there. The drop in water has been faster than predicted. At this rate, Lake Hylia will dry up. It's a race against time. We've had absolutely no water flowing from the stream. Uh, there's no mistake that something must have happened. The water source is in our homes, or is the main. Yet how we are we to re how are we to return upstream to our home? With the way things are now, we can't even walk back there. There must be a way. For now, we just need to find a way back upstream to Zora's domain. I wonder if the queen and our peers in Zora's domain are safe. Oh, sad stuff. If you already know what's coming, it's, it's a lot of sad stuff. But you guys don't, and I won't spoil anything. But anyway, oh look at this guy. Uh, I'm too old for this. Far in Felby's water top land of fantastication. It's our grand reopening at our new lake bottom location. We... Uh, yeah, nice lake. Don't lakes have uh, more, I don't know, water? It deserves who live up river to do something. Or is it a curse from the spirit that flows around up there? Whatever, it's not like I can go up and complain. It's way too high. What? Huh? A customer? Yikes! It's a monster! A monster! I'll take care of it! I am Link! A wolf Link! The monster of all wolf links! Hello there! Haha! -ha. You are no match for me! For I am a beast! And what are you doing? What are you doing? No! Hey dude, that's my plant! I'm the one who... Plants that... What, 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 what are you, what are you... Dude, dude, that's not, no, not cool, not a big fan of what you are doing now, sir, no, 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 I do not approve of your, um, whatever do I call you, get out, ow, ow, oh, 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 damage, 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 stop howling, you son of, can you not think, please? I wonder if we would use the ferry. I have a ferry, but uh, oh, it's coming for us. I think. Boom! No, Sh mother! No, I missed. Oh god! Okay, jump, 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 jumping, back flipping, wolf, black flipping, wolf, black flipping, black flipping. God, what am I saying? Even I don't even know more anymore at this point. Anyway, he's coming in for another attack. Let's actually do the right attack this time. Boom! No. God! What? He- What the? What? I have never had this ha I'm dead. Please sell- Okay, fairies work. Fairies work in wolf form. That's good. Uh, I was going to use my Zelda Amiibo at some point, but... Uh, I guess we're- We're good. Can you attack me in a way I can counter it, please? This is not supposed to be such a long boss fight. Okay, there we go! Kill you! Okay, well... I guess I have to wait a bit more. How much damage did that do? I wonder what... Like, because I only had one and a half hearts, I don't know how much attack that damage actually does. It might be like four hearts. Um, as far as I know. Anyway, oh, he didn't even attack me in the meantime. Cool. He's got a straight cool kill. Uh, do you die? No, he does not die. He don't die. He don't die. Boom! Now you die. Okay, cool. And now the bird is like, What's up? I'm a bird. Hello. Oh, that's right. We have to do like all of this shit before we can even... Oh, my days. Uh, yeah, let's go to the water source. My god, we don't even get to go to the spirit yet. This is a long part of the game. 
I forgot about that. Well, anyway, we're gonna cool, do a cool mini game. I don't know how this will control in this version, actually. Uh, with the Wii, you had to point at the screen at where you wanted to fly, but now it's gonna be all different, I think. Right? Um, tilting the gamepad, that is not doing anything. No, it's airplane controls, okay. I'm fine with that. This is fine. Ooh, this is gonna take some getting used to though. Oh, there's gonna be like some actually some pretty difficult mini games with this that I'm gonna have to get used to. Uh, this new flight uh, way because I was just really good at that mini game um, with the whole aiming to. Can I kill these guys? Nope. <laughs> Let's not even try. Oh dear! Those are falling rock pillars, spires. Oh, where are we going? Uh, you can't go up there, you can't go up there, you can't go up there. Don't try because you will fall. <laughs> uh, you speak from experience. <laughs> experience of two years ago, to be exact. That's a long time. Can't, still can't believe that it's been so long since I played this game, you know? Like, time really just flies by when when you're young as well. Uh, and I'm only getting older. And it's weird to think about stuff like that. Like, I'm going to university. Like, I'm Within a month, I'll be doing my final exams. It's crazy when you think about it. But oh well. Let's move on. Where did these guys get all those bombs, Aris? Like, did they talk to Barnes about that? Barnes, why are you supplying the enemy, dude? That's not cool. <laughs> anyway, we are all the way to the top of this little section. Which is pretty cool. I like this. Quite a lot. But I, I think it's annoying that we didn't yet get the option of getting getting the tears of light thing because I already killed one of the bugs there's more bugs over here but there's just no way of um, of bugging stuff yeah anyway hello there spirit um, oh we're already dead that bird's trying to be more useful than I expected well uh, where's the village of the Zoras let's look for it it's getting cold hurry up getting cold what do you mean it's getting cold? Hello. I mean, what are those servers up to anyway? The roof has run totally dry, right? I can't work like this. Uh, cold. Uh, I miss my fur coat. Well, sounds like a you problem. <laughs> uh, I love saying that. Whoa, is that ice? That's ice. Jeez. This is ice down here. Whoa. It's so cold! Boom! Alright, let's uh, run across the ice. Can I slide on the ice? Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> never mind, I guess. Hello. Where are we now? It's all so bright, I can't see. <laughs> uh, oh, right, we are in Zora's domain. Look at that. There's all these fossils on the wall, which I think is really cool. I like that design. Hey, what's going on here? I thought it was getting colder, but who would thought all would be frozen? This is the Zora Village, right? Why don't I see any then? Well, anyway, let's find... check things out and find the Zoras. Where are the Zoras? There's no Zoras! No Zoras around! And there's bats, though. I don't like bats. Kill the bats. Bats must die. Hello. Bats! Must die. There you go. Can you get up there, Link, please? That would be helpful. Hey, I think we can get it up from here. Yes, that would be a good thing. Because getting up is awesome. Alright. And we can go even further up. It's a good thing we killed the... What was that? What was that? <laughs> good thing we killed those bats. Because they would have been a pain otherwise. Anyway, let's get up. What has happened? Oh, wow, damage. That was a lot of damage, actually. Alright, let's try it again. We need to go all the way back up. Alright, without failing this time, that would be nice. What? Ow. Um, one more fall and I'm gonna have to use my amiibo. Damn it, I don't want to use amiibos. What? Wolf segments without amiibos are impossible because you're just gonna die for stupid reason. No, not please just activate your thingy. All right, let's need to take more time here. Oh god, 
Yes, continue on, Midna. <laughs> Get me all the way up. Oh, and we are all the way up now. Kill the bats. Because the bats are annoying. Right. Why, hello there. This is the throne room of these Zoras. Which, once again, I don't know why it isn't seamless. Oh, dear. Um, it's going for the sneaky sack. Sneak attack! Bah! Oh, uh, sorry, we need to go over here first. Kill this guy. And now it is your turn. Don't worry, I didn't forget about you. How could I? How could I forget about my favorite two Twilight Beasts? Alright. Hello. How are you? A portal has opened here too. We can finally warp. If you want to breathe the air of the world of life for a moment, let me know. I'll take you there. Yes. Because there's something important. We need to get from over my favorite place. We're going to go to Death Mountain. That is the coolest place in the world, of course. But it's also a very useful place. Because, of course, the Zora's Domain is all frozen over. And it is quite hot in the Death Mountain area. So what could we possibly do... I don't know. Actually, one little detail we missed that I forgot to check out is you can actually stand above the ice and Z-target and look down and you will see all the Zoras frozen in underneath the throne room, which is pretty cool. But anyway, what best thing to do when there's a bunch of fishes stuck in a bit of ice is to f dump some kind of lava rock on top of it. So, let's just warp this thing out. All the Gorons are just kind of looking at it like nothing's happening. They don't even notice it, you know? Like, oh, floating rock! Uh, it's fine, I'm just uh, keeping guard here. Alright. Let's see. Uh, apparently Twilight um, transportation does not uh, involve any heat reduction, so we should be all good on um, dissolving the Zora's Domain, and this is probably one of the coolest looking cutscenes in the game. There we go. That's a big rock fits in perfectly. Oh, damn. That's a lot of water. It just instantly melted the ice as well. Boom! <laughs> and then everything melts. Because it's hot water. Because of the lava rock, of course. Look at that. There's, like, smoke everywhere. It's not smoke, I know that. But I don't know what else it's called. And all of Zora's domain, all the problems are gone. I don't know how one rot hot rock would f solve all the water problems in this game, but apparently it does. I am not here to judge. <laughs> Look at that. All the Zoras are back. And they're all safe, despite being potentially hit by a lava rock. That would be so funny. If underneath the lava rock, if you would look on the water, there'd actually just be some Zora limbs sticking out under the rock, like one of the Zoras had been crushed. That would be funny. And very morbid. Anyway, uh, the Zoras are safe now, so let's go. Yeah, it's melted, and we sort the water flow to normal. Can we finally meet the Spirit of Lake Hylia? Uh, yeah, the Zoras are fine, they're only... They're only <laughs> dead. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, they're not actually dead. I mean, dead people can't make dots, but... Huff, huff. <laughs> they're nearly dead. I mean, we did drop a giant rock of boiling hot lava on top of them. So, wait! Wait. I'm waiting. Ooh, it's the spirit. Hello, boob spirit. Um, please, you must allow me to thank you for revitalizing both my people and the spring, which is the water source for all the lands of Hyrule. In life, I was the elder of the Zora village, and I was the queen of my people. I was called Rutella. Not to be rude, but we didn't exactly do it for you guys. The Dark Ones. They raided this village and messed to my people, executed me before them. Wow. That is cruel. And... Wow. Anyway, Midna, you are pretty dickish of saying it. And I love how she, like, Ritella just ignores what Midna says and goes like, The Dark Ones. <laughs> uh, young man, you take the form of a proud beast. I have something to ask of you. When the Dark Ones descended on my village, I sent my young one, Raelus, to Hyrule Castle to inform Princess Alda of our fate. But I feared danger followed him from his doomed place. 
I feel it. This person just grow fainter to me over time. But in my time in this world, but my time is in this world has passed, and I would give it gladly. I could no longer li have a life risk in his rescue. Please, would you save my dearest prince? Prince Raj. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a bit tired. If you do this thing, I will bestow upon the protection of water. This power will grant you the ability to swim and respire in the very deep water if you, as if you were a Zora. Please save my son. I shall. No worries. So if we help her, she will grant the power to swim in deep water like a Zora, huh? So what do you say, hero? Oh. But no, now that I think about it, you I don't suppose you should meet the prince as a wolf, huh? So, no hurry to return to the wall of light then. Uh, yeah. I suppose. Let us go back down to the lake. And what's the fastest way to do that? Well, I think Mitna has a plan. Do you know Mitna? Oh, it's rain as well now. This is a lot of water. Hmm. Looks like the shock of the impact has not only raised it, but a little bit sped up the flow too. Well, she flow all, all the way down the lake. Why don't you take it? <laughs> there. Oh, that seems like the best idea ever, Mitna. Why don't we let the water take us to the lake? Uh, might not be... Might, might be slightly dangerous. Oh god. Look, it sounds like Link is not really approving of this idea by a whole deal. Um, are you okay there? What's going on? Oh, look, the water's back to normal levels. Oh, we're washed up on the shore. Well, uh, Link's like fucking hell. Aren't you awake yet? <laughs> Screw you, Mitna. Look, we got washed away all the way down to Lake Hyde, just as I predicted. And it looks like we're right in front of the Spirit Springs 2 boot. Talk about lucky. Well, let's go. Snap out of it and get to the Spirit. Alright, we'll get to the Spirit in the next episode of Sons of the Twilight Prince HD. Thank you guys very much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.